All right, we got a game today. Thanks for watching. Should be a good one against Grubenstein. Doing random. And he gets to go first. Oh. I got a glimpse of the tray. First, let me change my volume here. Make sure y'all can hear what's going on. Maybe it's just me, but every time I do random, I usually go second. Anyway, uh, Chipping Sparrow and Martin. Based on round goals and just engine building, I'm thinking he's he's got to take the Martin. Or he's going to. Groove's a really good player. Obviously been on Discord for a long time. This is not a tournament game. Uh... We both, I think, do a lot of tournaments. We've been matched up together several times, back and forth. He can correct me, but I think it's pretty 50-50 as far as wins go. Uh, it's going to be tough, regardless. All right, what did we get? Okay. Not, not, not terrible. Um, pops out to me, of course, is the Robin. I'm going to do Diet Specialist. I think I can get two birds with a cost of three food versus Breeding Manager. I think. Problem is, I don't have any uh, draw power with the wetlands, so it's going to be difficult. But if he takes the Martin, I can get the Sparrow, play the Robin, and the Nutcracker for maybe a Forest Engine. Don't do many Forest Engines, but even if I don't utilize the Nutcracker, one seed for five points is pretty good value. Lincoln Sparrow and thought about it. And Blue Jay is a possible point scorer, but I don't think so. I'd rather have something like like a nut hatch or chickadee cash food. Um tough choices here. And again, I have no wetland birds. So, I'm going to do one food and keep four birds. To try to power this robin. See what we get. We're going for the forest engine. We're doing it. Why not? I think he's going to take the Martin. Now I get the sparrow. Might not be able to participate in the grassland, uh, eggs in the grassland goal. So I think we're going to be down four points. Food. He's already got quite a bit of food, so guess he didn't keep many cards. Chipping Sparrow first. How to build a forest engine? Need an egg layer in force. So we got that. We got potential draw power with the Robin. We're gonna need some help later on with some more cards, but. Thanks for watching. Hope y'all are entertained by this. Groove said on Discord he wanted a quick one.
Uh-oh. White stork. It's not good, people. Uh, I like to try to add some commentary and, and think out loud here, but this might be a quick game, we'll see. I just played a game right before this against the White Stork, Raven, and Gull. With the Bush Tit and the Chaffinch, so I lost 113 to 100. Tried my best. But now I face the White Stork again. Um. So, he's going to reset the tray a lot, thinking about the cuckoo. If he's going to spam the white stork, and I want some eggs, I, I, I'm debating. I know the sparrow is going to give me eggs, but I'm going to take the cuckoo, because... I'm going to need all the eggs I can get, I think. I'm not going to be able to get it down early, but we'll try. Hoping this robin uh, can show us a wood duck. That would make the game, I think. Help me out a lot. <clears throat> so. Might be weird, but I think I'm gonna get this sparrow, Savannah sparrow. I'll tell you why in a second. I am taking the sparrow for the potential it has to progress my grassland. It's not a huge move or a huge play, but if we have to pivot to the grassland and this forest engine doesn't work out, putting a couple birds down with the sparrow, maybe I can make up some ground, we'll see. He's got the Martin, yep, he'll win the first in the round. Thinking about putting the nutcracker in, but let's use grassland engine. I'm going to gain food. I'm trying to see if I. Yeah. Yep. I think we're good. We're still good. Um, whoops, Blue Jay's not bad, but I think I want something better. Golden Eagle. Golden Eagle. If I get enough food, maybe I can drop it. He'll probably win next end of round goal as well with the uh, with the stork. Man, it's gonna be tough. Let's see. Go ahead and get the cuckoo down. <clears throat> All right. 
some bonus card birds. Um, not my favorite. Spotted Owl doesn't really go with my engine. Um, looking at the Oyster Catcher right now. And the Savannah Sparrow may have to go. I got it just in case, but check it. Ah, oh, no rats for the Golden Eagle. That's a bummer. It's alright though. Just need some cards. <clears throat> Wouldn't mind if he picked up the blue throat and gave me some food. It'd be really good for him, but Yep. No you picked that up. He's either denying or playing it, but I bet he's playing it. It goes well with the his grassland. He's a, a pretty nice setup, but he's running out of egg space. That's my only hope. Um, let's go ahead and get this nutcracker. Wondering if I should. Uh, think I'm gonna have to just draw one. I hate to draw one card. I don't think I'm gonna draw one card. The reason being, I want to play both of these birds, and uh, if I gain food, I'm not gonna be able to utilize the robin. But gain food. That and um, first cash, why not? Yeah. I had no draw power. Start a game. It's pretty risky to try to go for a forest engine, but we'll see. Okay, Nuthatch, Godwit, Kestrel. Hmm. The nut hatch would be one, two, three, four. That would be a four point play every time. Godwit, I know he's gonna bomb me with it later. So that's gonna hurt, but I think but the Godwit goes with the uh with the end of round goals too. I don't know man, you might get the Godwit here. Tell me in the comments, what, what do you think uh, you would choose here, Nuthatch or Godwit? Nuthatch helps me with my engine. Godwit is a six pointer, or a five pointer bonus card and draw three. Hurts me Nuthatch, but I think it also helps me with my bonus card. Doing it. Sorry, Groove. I know you wanted a quick one, but uh, gotta think hard to try to beat you. <laughs> like I said, help me win the bonus cards. 
think the points were just too much. In the nut hatch, you play it. It's a neutral zero point play at first. And it'd take me a while a while to get as much value as, as this bird, so. But we got our extra cards, we can tuck the robin. And again, food, play the godwit. Draw cards, probably. We'll see. We're trying to stay competitive. Forced engines, I usually have the wood duck, and obviously don't have that right now. So we're gonna have to dip into our wetlands every now and then to get some cards. He's gonna kill me on eggs, I have no grassland. It's gonna be tricky. Now, I'm taking the bluebird. Maybe I can use it later to expand our uh, grassland later. Pretty straightforward game for him, I think. He's just grasslands every every turn. Probably we'll probably get in a lot of extra food. He draws cards, he gets eggs, and just plays as many high point birds as he can while he tucks. So tough setup. But we're getting a point with the cuckoo. At least two points from these guys, and then maybe towards the end. Nutcracker can start cashing some seeds. What's y'all's favorite forest uh, forest engine bird? All right, if he gives me seeds, that's good for us. He's running out of egg space. Um, need something good here. Birds with backyard burger. Not my first choice by any means. Okay, we only get to keep one. It's a nice bomb right there. Uh, thinking about the. Um, I only get to keep one, so. Yeah, that's good. We will keep this one. I think I might tuck and try to get the egret. Because why not? I mean the heron. The great blue heron. Play the heron, trumpeter swan, and just go for bird bombs, I guess. Let's see. Looks like we might have won the second end of round goal, unless he hits me with a brant, which he has. Oh no, he doesn't have the food for the brant. So I think we're okay to win this goal. Might as well.
<clears throat> Prospero, he will be giving me seeds for my uh, nutcracker. So we're hanging in there, people. Thought he might win this second end around goal, but uh, he can't keep utilizing the stork without the egg space, yada yada. He's got to play birds, so. And he has four tucks, and we have four tucks, so. I don't know. It's an intimidating grassland. I will just say that. Saw the kill deer pop up on the tray. So the kill deer is gone. Oh, Canada goose. If he gets Canada goose with the uh, blue throat, um, could be a tough combination right there. Oh man. I'm gonna get the Avocet. I'm gonna put the Avocet down. Mm -hmm. Help me with the goal and uh, help me with eggs. Pink powers, obviously. And if he picks up the goose and tries to run that engine, then he's discarding the seeds that he ultimately needs for the house sparrow so those I feel like they kinda counter each other like you kinda gotta choose either or maybe or maybe he's just denying me um, alright nothing we need oh but he reset the tray so we couldn't get the app set with the white slope sad day okay um, that's wingspan. Let's go ahead and get some more food so we can play some of these birds. Okay. We got our rats that we need. Can't use you right now. Nothing bird. Oh shoot, I just messed up. Should have laid the egg on the back tail, god with. It's okay. I think we're all right. He did play the honey buzzard. Interesting. Round three. I didn't think he was struggling for food, but maybe. I guess he only has the blue throat. So he has two ground nests. I have two. Let's go ahead and make it three. I get another bonus card bird, a wetland scientist, a wetland specialist, I forget what it's called, might be good, I think it's wetland scientist.
force engines. Uh, well, come back to that. Gain food. He only has two egg spaces. Like I said, he's going to kill me on eggs, so that's, that's our issue. But. Let me see. What do we need here? We need as many seeds as possible for the end of the game. And no seeds. Of course. I guess we'll take a fish. Bush tit. Be great for him, but uh, not for me. Not in this setup, I don't think. I need cards, I don't need to tuck them. A lot of egg spaces, though. You know, I could. You know, honestly, I gotta think about this now. So he put another one of those. You got another ground nest, yeah. So now, thinking about that bush to if this is where I may be transitioning grassland. I still like my forest engine. It's just not as powerful as a grassland engine could be. I don't think. I'm gonna play this one. Get a fourth ground nest. Play these two. And we might be good. Maybe. We shall see. This might be a mistake here. Uh, but I'm going to play it. Okay. We'll see. I just don't know how many more extra cards I'm going to have to tuck under the bush tip, but it helps me maybe win this end of round goal. And if I have to expand my grassland out for the last few turns in round four, it might help me. We'll see. At first I said I didn't need the bush tip, but I'm trying it. And we needed to draw cards anyway for the robin, so ooh, point bomb. One, two, three, four. Alright, so that's his fourth ground mist. He's going to win that one. I mean uh, we're gonna tie that one. Excuse me. Interesting. Okay. Three cards in the wetlands. That's my wetland engine. Nothing special. Just give me the cards. This backyard burger, it's not, I don't, I don't think this is, this is happening. I really wanted a, uh, some bonus card birds, so we could bomb those at the end, but we'll see. Feel free to let me know in the comments if you would have done something differently. Um, there's always the second guesses. If you saw some mistakes, I'd be happy to read your thoughts. Sure, why not? Another seed. That's good. Alright. So, we will. Do this. Thinking about discarding the food here for another egg, but I may need that later to play a big point bird, so we'll roll with it. And black turn. Don't want.
Excuse me. Let's see if his honey buzzard has any luck. Another one more. Not the best. All right, collared dove. Interesting. I may want the collared dove because I have potentially some extra food here. So, yeah. I think I'm going to go for the collared dove. to make it happen people I'm gonna cash one seed I think I think I'm either gonna cash it or spend it later on the Eurasian color dub so Ooh. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We need a worm, people. We need a worm. What am I thinking? Because I want to double play with the, with the uh, bluebird. Oof. Almost messed up right there. Alright, Great Horned Owl, my name's Outstanding on the Discord. But, ain't happening today. So, he's got more brown powers than me. He's got six and I've got four. And I only have one more brown power bird that I'm probably going to play. I don't know. These last four cards are tricky. The eagle is going to help me with this one. Seven points, six or seven points with the fly catcher. I'm going to play this one. That's a 12 minus two. That's a 10 point play plus the bonus card. It's a 13 point play. That's what I'm going to do next. And then I'm going to gain food. Oh, he got all those seeds. For his house sparrow. Okay. Well, we're still gonna do this. Um, is that the right play? It's fly catcher. Yep, that's good. Come on, team. With Groove, it's usually almost close. I mean, uh, it's almost always a close game. Usually. I'm sure he's killed me once before, but there's the Canada Goose. I think we're going to it's only a three point play, four point play. Yeah. 
Gonna gain some food, hope for some seeds. We didn't get a berry though. That kind of sucks. Maybe go for it the next turn. Uh, cash those two. Scissor tail isn't happening today. Snowy owl. Interesting. Snowy owl. There's two rats in the tray. Give me another bonus card. Got this goose and Martin. I don't know, the dove's gonna be a three point play minimum. And then plus the extra food I'm gonna cash. Or er, tuck. Oh, he just gave me more seeds. This is good. Probably for his goose. Okay. Bill's Vireo in the tray. I can't really do anything about it. This is a four, five, six point play. And this is a, depending on how many seeds we get, like a four point play. What, what would y'all do in this situation? Uh, tell me. Snowy Owl, Bell's Vireo, Eurasian Collar Dove. There's so many options these last two turns. I could just lay eggs and get, what, four, six points? It's 12 points the last two turns, plus Golden Eagle. I don't know. It's debatable. And then the Collar Dove, I just feel like three plus another five food. That's an eight point play eventually. And I have all this extra food, so I think I'm just going to keep going with, with our original plan. Uh, one, two, three. There we go. No, yeah. Uh, might as well pick him up. Could roll the dice with Bell's Virio. I could probably do Oologist bonus card. Um, that was a three, four, that was a five point play. A lot of what ifs. Uh, I could completely whiff on the bonus card. I could get wetland specialist. Interesting. So if I lay eggs, that's a six point play. Eurasian Dove, that's going to be a three plus another three, that's a six point play. Actually, he just gave me food, so that's a seven point play. Or, forget all those six point plays and just go with the Virio. Sticking with the people. Tell me what you think. Or what you would have done. I'm liking it. I like our... Our, uh, our effort. He had a really good grassland going. And again, he's going to kill me on eggs, but... 
He doesn't have a whole lot of birds out there. I have 12, he has 9. Um, and most of my birds are kind of on the higher range. I'm thinking we maybe eat this one out. Maybe. His eggs are just crazy though, compared to mine. I knew that Canada goose was gonna hurt me later. Backyard birder for me is just always an accidental fulfillment, almost. Like sometimes I'll purposely go for it or, you know, try to complete the seven towards the end if I'm if I'm making it happen, but to actively play one point birds, one, two, three, or zero point birds, to actively try to do that, the risk reward there just just doesn't work out usually. At least for me. He is thinking hard here. I assume he's going to play a bird. Oh? Did he tuck? I mean, no, he laid eggs. Okay. Um, so he got a, uh, what, like a two, three point play, maybe? All right, let's cash our extra. Worked out perfectly. Moment of truth, people. Let's see it. <clears throat> okay. Uh, his eggs, though. Hmm. I don't know. It's gonna be close. Are you serious? Of course. 107, 107. Is this for real right now? Did that honey buzzer do it? How much food do I have? I tucked all my food. I told you it was gonna be close. That's crazy. You can count on one or two hands how many food ties you get, and he wins with the food. So, uh, what bonus cards did he have? He had fishery manager. Yeah. Well, we tried, people. Valiant effort. I knew it was going to be a close game to get second with 107. You know, I, I don't, I don't know what other things we could have done there. But, thank you for watching. Hope y'all were entertained. Maybe I should have just kept going with Forrest uh, the whole game, but I kind of pivoted and tried to lay some big birds there. Fun one. See y'all next time.